Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Vedans World. So we have done a one video where we have uploaded how to learn a rep trick. This is the second video where I'm teaching you how to learn a how to learn roller skates. So okay. I'll teach you from full beginning detail. Okay. At the end, I'll do demos that will be in blazing speeds. I okay. hope you gain confidence and learn with us. So. First, when you buy this, there are two options: non-inliner or inliner. Inliner means straight, and mm. uh, non-inliner means one, 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 like this: one, 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 one. Okay. So two front, two back. Okay, got it. Uh, for beginner, I recommend two front, two back. But I didn't buy that. I directly bought this because that was out of stock. And it is good also. Yeah, I learned this without learning that. Okay, that's right. One good. up. <laughs> that's what they call it. So any side you can have a break, but each one side you have to have a break for stopping. What's a break? Can you show? The break is rubber. Just to like when you are when you want to stop. Okay. Okay. So I teach you how to wear it. First, sit or stand. I recommend. I. Stand, but sitting is much better. Okay. Put your foot. If there's this behind carrying thing, mm. then good. Otherwise, just pull it and then slide your foot in. Like you wear shoes. Yeah, but you need to put the laces also. Your laces are already on, but it's okay. I'll, ideally, you should put the laces, correct? No, there are some without laces. Okay. So I'm not telling them that. Okay. Then when this is done. Pull this up mm -hmm. as much as it can go, and then when it's like this, just slide it in these two between, like this. It should be in between of this and this. Okay. Next step, you can have two. You can have three things. One, one strap, two strap. Mm. That everyone knows. Mm. That's like my shoes. Okay. Now, second thing, it's like mine. The top one is a slider thing, and the Bottom one is a strap. Okay. The third scenario is that you can have this slider thing and the bottom slider thing. I have this, so I'll show you. But all for the strap, just pull, pull, and tie your lace. Okay. The third scenario, I'll do the second and last because mine is second. Hmm. So the third scenario, you have to take this, and this should not be locked. If this is like this, just pull it out. And it will not come that simple. It might be like stuck, so you have to kind of pull it. When you pull this thing out, then hold this so it doesn't come out again and again. So hold this, then take this, hold it from the edge here, slide it in this. It's kind of confinement. So slide it; it will go in. Then, then slide however much you have to fit. If my leg is this side, I'll do this much. My leg is this size. I do this much, but my leg is small, so I fully do it. Then push this in again. Hold it. You have to pull, and it, this part will be a little hard if you are if you are doing it very tight. You have to actually pull it. Then when it's stuck here, push. It will go in. Yeah, so basically it should be and very tight. And then repeat yeah. that here. Hmm. The second scenario. Is this? Hmm. You do the top one, done, and tie your laces. Okay. Okay. Let's wear the other one. And the second is also same. Do this. Pull from back. Pull this up. Put it in between these two. Slide this in. Do not slide it full in. You have to slide it as much as your leg can hold it. Means suppose if your leg is kind of big, so do it little bit, as much as that can fit you. Okay. Put this back inside. Push it. Close this. Pull this. And do this. Okay. I have worn mine. And for a beginner, I would recommend taking the wall support. Okay. And wearing a helmet. 
Yes. Okay. But if you want to be more safe, wear the guards on your knees and elbows. Yeah, and you need to take help of someone. No, you can take help of wall if you are a beginner. But I'm not a beginner, so I can just get up. Hmm. Well, I will just fall. <laughs> if I do it, I will just fall. <laughs> yeah. So for a beginner, take support and then balance. Learn to balance. When you have mastered balancing, the second step is to start moving. So you can walk like this. Okay, I've got an idea. Like that, you can walk. Like how a penguin walks, or like this. Actually, actually, I remembered when you started learning long, long time ago. We wore this, and you walked in the sand or on the uh, grass. Grass. So your so just my walk. feet doesn't like slip. Yeah, just walk. So walk like this. Yeah, you just have to practice. That's it. Like so this, you get you hang of it. Master this. The next step is doing with the wall. This step you have to do with the wall. So go to the wall. Then, then you can take support. You can take no support, but that will be risky. Do that with guards. Hmm. I would recommend that. So if you're doing with wall, do like this. Hold the wall. Then slide your feet like this. Side. As if someone is pushing your feet outside like this. Push your feet outside. It's here. Okay. Go like as if a train track is separating itself like this. As if a train track is going like that, but one by one, one. But uh, initially, I think they should learn as a train track, straight, straight, straight. One, two, three, four, then straight. One, two, three, four, straight. Yeah. One, you have to teach them. So the balance, so starting is one, one two, two, three, four, straight. That is train track. Yeah, the straight is kind of like a train track or a train. When you have mastered this, the next step is to get speed. No, next step, the last step is to get speed. So the, the next step is to kind of do it. Not one, two, three, four, but do it more. So do it more, 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 more. And then eventually, with the time of this, you will automatically gain speed. Like this. See? If I do it one, two, three, four, this is how much speed I gain. But if I do it more, like eight, one, two, three, four. Focus on balancing and more of doing this instead of straight. The next step is to learn turning. Okay. So kind of you walk and turn. Do practice this. You kind of walk and turn. Then, then put that same mechanic which feet like this. Slow speed first. Do it at low speed, like this. As if you are walking and turning. Like usually people do this while walking. But here you have to make it extra long, like this. Then eventually you have to start gaining speed. to mention in the starting keep your knees a little bent don't keep them straight keep it a little bent like this this much don't keep it like this this you want to be able to do when you do the turn you will fall so I will show you both types of turn this is the first and this is the second 
So while riding, do I need to, uh, what do you say, take my foot up one and down or something like that? No, you have to glide it. But while riding, you have to glide your foot. If you are, if you are mastered gliding, then only you will progress further. This is first, then you have to start gliding the foot. Pick it up a little, then glide. So I'll show you all of the demos. See, this is my slow speed. This is my slow speed. I'm just walking. See, I'm not even gliding. I'm just walking. Now this is my medium speed. This is my medium speed. This is my high. And how do we put the brakes? Yeah, brakes. I forgot. I forgot. Thanks for reminding me. When you're too fast and something in front of you. Oh, there's a chair in front of me. Just pull your leg up and then push your leg down as hard as you can. Okay, any other way to stop? Um, uh, one. <laughs> That's mother. <laughs> okay. This is my mother. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know her. <laughs> okay. I'm just joking. This is actually the only way. Okay. Or you can just do this. Wait, I'll show you here. Hmm. But don't do that on speed. Yeah. Mostly like. And I'll show you one trick that I know. Okay. Of this. It's picking my leg up. It's my picking. And I'll pick my leg up. Like this. Wow. Once more. Uh, I one trick to slow down also I know that I can teach you. Yes, please. But, so if, like but if I happen to Ooh. collide both of my legs together, then I will fall. No, I can touch it together and ride. I'll show you. See. I'll touch both legs and still ride. Or not touch both uh, wheels and touch my legs. Okay, I'm still scared. If I do it, I might fall uh, when no, I'm starting. No, I, I'm telling for a pro. Do, beginner, don't do that. You will definitely fall. When you try, yeah. That will happen. 
So beginner, uh, do the main steps, and then pro, if you get, if you're getting a hang on it, try to do the tricks. Okay. But uh, I recommend while doing tricks, wear the guards and the helmet. Okay. Uh, what about it? See, uh, someone just do like this and falls. This is one trick. This is another. It looks so easy, but I don't think it is easy. I'm not moving. I'll move backwards. I'm moving backwards. This is the second trick. See what I do to stop. Sometimes that's what I do. So, if you like this you can learn with me and uh, we can have fun together yeah i'm just still wondering how do i start if i do it the first step the very first step when i do it when i get up from the chair i'll show you again. and if when i you your, when you get up you will have to have a support to balance when you learn balancing then you can uh, go ahead to the other steps Hmm. Okay. So you have to like be beside a wall, or if you are a risk taker, do this. If you are a risk taker. Yeah, but <laughs> the person should not fall. Yeah, if you want the biscuit. Hmm. You will have to risk it for the biscuit. Okay. So guys, if you like my video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. So guys. Yeah. Show me one more round before uh, we say bye. Okay. Uh. Okay, one second. Fast, medium or slow? Whatever. Fast. <laughs> so guys i hope you liked this video if you liked it hit that like button hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell so guys bye and i'll i'll show you another teaching video sometime peace